Take a break, Chris. What's going on, everybody? KSA Chris here, the Real Estate Blitz. And uh, I, I just did a video, and I'm probably not going to post it because it was full of a lot of foul language and anger. Um, however, this is kind of part two of the video that I probably won't post, and it really is uh, talking about there is a difference between a CRM. There's a difference between a CRM and a lead capture IDX system, okay, uh, that has a CRM. I had somebody call me yesterday on my cell phone, and I took time to speak with them. And I'll, without cussing, I'm going to bring this in. And I tried to explain to them. So they're like, yeah, you know, I'm going to implement Sync. And I says, great. You know, what are you looking to do? What's your volume? Do you have a team? And uh, all, all this person need to do over and over and over is tell me that they've been in the business for 35 years. Yet they produce only a couple deals every few months. And I'm like, Sync ain't for you yet. Okay. But their idea was, and this is where there's a lot of confusion. People think Sync is a CRM. They're willing to spend money. So they think it's two parts. They think it's a CRM, which it has a CRM, but that's not the intent of Sync completely. It does have a CRM, but you can purchase a CRM if that's all you need. A majority of this guy's business was coming from past deals from over the last 35 years, right? So he wasn't producing any inbound lead generation. He was hoping he could just spend money and he would just get more deals. Like it's somehow magical. So if I just spend money and I buy sync, I'm just going to make money. Look, it doesn't work that way. If it did, if it did, if you didn't have to put in any work to make money in this business, dude, like, but nobody would do anything. Nobody would ever get a job. They would all be real estate agents. And yeah, there's already a lot of real estate agents. So let me tell you something. Even if you get a platform or a system, you have to work it to include a CRM. The best CRM is the one that you will actually use. It doesn't, you know, and he's like, well, I've tried this CRM and it's no good. And I'm listening. I'm like, that's a fantastic CRM. It has an amazing AI. It's, it's back end. It's fantastic. So you're just not using it. You're looking for a simple solution and a simple, uh, just if I throw money at it, I'll just make money. That's garbage. It's not going to work. And I'm trying not to get worked up because this guy got me so hot, which is why I probably won't post the last video I posted up or I, I thought about posting and I did. I recorded so um, first off, there's a difference between a CRM and an inbound IDX feed. Let's talk about the two. A CRM, a CRM is specific to managing clients, whether they're past clients, whether they're inbound clients, whether it's whatever. And you can set up drip campaigns. It's, a, it's an opportunity to make calls. It's an opportunity to make notes. And it's also an opportunity to hold you accountable because you actually create tasks and everything else. But it's just that. That does not, that CRM does not do any work exterior to what it is and the energy and work that you put into it. Um, or if you set up drip campaigns so it can reach out to people. Now, let's talk about an inbound lead generation system. That's a website. So Sync, Boomtown, there's a whole bunch of them, a myriad of them, uh, real geeks. I could keep going. That's it. That system's entire job is to do some type of advertising based off of when you want to bring people into your website to view homes, to buy, uh, to buy, or you want to bring them into your website to try to get um, some type of valuation on the sale of a home so you could help them sell. As they come in, you're capturing their information their name, their address, their email address, whatever you can, address that they're potentially looking to sell. And that's done through uh, some form of advertising. It could be paid advertising uh, through Google, through Facebook, through whatever. There's a ton of different areas that you could do paid advertising through. Or it could just be through good old fashioned sweat equity, um, through uh, you know Facebook blast. It could be through sharing with friends, through uh, text messaging, with sphere of influence. I mean, there's a ton of different ways that you could do it. But the goal is that you're putting out this website to get people to the website so they will engage with the website. And in return, you capture their information, which is put into the CRM so you can start doing work. It's not going to do it for you. You still have to call these people. Now, can you pay people? Can you pay a service to do that for you? Yes, you can. There's agentology. There's a ton of different services that you can pay to actually do that follow-up process for you. My question has always been, and same thing that I'm teaching with the Six Figure Agent Program, the KSA Real Estate Group Brokerage. Um, if you don't even know what the basics are, how do you know what you're supposed to be paying somebody? Or you, what do you know what the returns should be? I know what the returns we get by, you know, eventually I started with myself. Now I've hired somebody in-house because I've used other systems like Agentology and other ones, and I know what returns I should be getting. 
but now I can train somebody in-house to actually start doing that stuff for me. And I also know what returns I should be getting so I can look at how much do I invest and how much do I get back, okay? I have an issue when I run into agents where like, I spent $10,000 to make $20,000 this year. That's horrible. That's horrible. That is a horrible return. If you're doing that, you should probably find something else to do or find a way to better maximize that. Anyways, long story short, the whole video of this was to talk about the differences. CRM is just a holding area for content information to help hold you accountable or to help you engage and, and mature people for potential deals in the future. An IDX system or a, a system that has IDX, but a lead capture system, an online website, or and there's other variations that are not online websites. There are other lead capture systems. So I, I, I've done a couple of videos on other ones like listings to leads. There are other lead capture systems. There's actually direct mail lead capture systems. Uh, Geographic Farm is a great example. Uh, go to geographicfarm.com. That's a direct mail process that actually has an online lead capture system to bring people in so they can go to your CRM. So you can start trying to reach out to them, speed the lead, and actually get more deals. Big difference. Big difference. So if you call me, don't sit there and try to argue with me on why your CRM sucks and how you need a different CRM. Especially, uh, I'm, I'm not going to get lost on that. Look, it's been six minutes. You heard me. You know what I said. I appreciate you all. Talk to you later. Bye.